Everybody knows Brady Ellison. But who we don't know, Tom Hall from Great Britain. <laughs> who has had a, a, had a very good day yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. He was like the floater in the draw, I think, really. The most unexpected he, because... He uh, had a good tournament in Marrakesh back in November. And he's, he's been coming up really strong the last year back in GB. He shot for the university team. Uh, Richard Priestman has been working with him since the early autumn. And I just said, OK, tell me what you do. He's like, oh, I'll shoot about 200 grams a week. Which is like, well, let's start with 200. Let's start with 200 a day. <laughs> Uh, and that's had a big effect. He's been doing a lot of work and really hard. A couple of little technical changes and nothing serious. Mm -hmm. So it's keen, he loves his archery. He just wants to enjoy himself today. He, he got knocked out by Brady last year in the first round, so he sees this as a rematch. <laughs> yes. Yeah, Brady's like, who's this guy? <laughs> But yeah, that's, that is the thing. You're not just shooting against Brady Ellis, you're shooting against reputation. Absolutely. And what a guy to be shooting against here. Yeah. 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 Three times Olympian. He got a silver team medalist last year in Rio and an individual bronze, which I know he was absolutely delight delighted with. I think Brady's relaxed since he's got that individual bronze. Yeah, because there is a lot of expectation. Um, remember, America have got a very good record at the Olympic Games. I mean, the, the legends yeah. of Jay Bars getting a, a gold, Rick McKinney getting multiple world Pace. championships, oh, Daryl sure. Pace, Hewish. So there's a lot of uh, legends to live up to. Yeah. So, but he's still young. He's uh, he's certainly got, got an impressive career. Um, good med med medal tally. He'll be in Tokyo. He'll definitely be in Tokyo, I'm sure. And, and he's certainly got other teammates that are chasing him, uh, to keeping him competitive. You're only as good as your opponents, I would yeah. say. And the Americans have lifted up as well to chase the Koreans, and they stepped up an unbelievable level in yeah. Rio. So, actually, so you've got master class in coaching out here now, look. Mel Nichols, Richard Priestman. <laughs> yes. Like, you know, I know we had a lot of top shooters in here as coaches well, today, top but coaches. now we've got some real coaches. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, it's, this is a great experience for Tom. You know, he's new. He's, he's new. I think we'll see a bit more of him in the next. Yeah. Years. Very explosive at the moment, but that's something that they're working on. Yeah. Braid is smoothing out a lot. I really do like the way if if you're uh, a recurve archer wanting to breath do look at his finger placement on the strings I mean yeah. they, it's solid his anchor point his fingers are really good on the string Long cold. Oh. perfect <laughs> this is, I, I watched I watched him shoot against the Korean um, and in the quarterfinals and what looked a bad shot ended up being the 10 yeah nice just to relax so relaxed buddy yeah so Tom is is working on on smoothing out because he's got a lot of tension in there which he knows. Yep. Um, but he is working on it. But he's dealing with it. Yep. Ten, and he, ten, he gets the ten. Got a set point. Which is good. That makes you feel a bit more relaxed. I think you want to get yeah. your 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 account open. You want to get your your name on the board, and he certainly has now. Yeah. No, it's really good. Good for Tom, one experience. He's just going to do himself. I uh, met him this morning, actually, you know, by, by the uh, coffee. So he was bound, bounding in. He was looking forward to it. <laughs> good. He's both. You, you've got to, really. He's like, how many other people do you know have got a 100% record against green archers? Yes. <laughs> yes, and he has at the moment. He has at the moment. Yeah. So there we go. No, it's really good. So this is quite a big stage for him. He hasn't uh, progressed this far in a stage before. So it's going to be a lot of emotions for, for Tom to try and uh, manage. And he's just got to try and channel those into uh, keeping calm and putting it into his technique. Um, it's the same bow, it's the same target, it's the same distance. Yeah. And that's what you've got to remind yourself. OK, it's a different country, it's the finals, you're shooting against Brady. one of the top archers in the world but just embrace it. Yeah, I see what you mean about that finger placement. I mean, it's just not going anywhere, is it? It's, it's no. really got a uh, good placement on the face. That front arm is driving through the middle. Ten. Yep. 
giving himself uh, some assurance there. Strong placement on the face. Yeah. And that's a heavy poundage Brady just will be no shooting. Creep, no, and he, he shoots every day, he works on it, and he loves his archer. I'm amazed. Yeah. He's, he's so young, but he's got a long career, and the motivation is still there. James getting nervous. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of movement. Nine. Yeah, it's a lot of movement, and he knows it. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. Yeah, it's a big moment for him. Brady's, I'll just keep shooting tens. Ten, ten, But he ten. looks very nice driven. Shoot. Brady looks very, very driven. Brady will want to win. Well, yeah, that's the thing. Whenever you shoot against Brady, he's only going to want to win. He's not yeah. going to give you an easy match. Yep. Oh. <laughs> 29, 29 for Tom. He's shot nice. Yeah. He just got a bit nervous on that. There's no time to come down and reset. Got to get it through. And that's the thing I, I really do admire with, with, with Brady is even when you watch him at qualification, he sticks to the same timing. Timing is so crucial in archery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he doesn't allow the occasion or... The, the challenge that's laid out before him intimidate him because I still, you could time your watch, he still has the same timing, the same rhythm. Yeah. He doesn't um, allow that to be intimidated. And he tries, uh, outdoors, he tries to get all of his arrows shot in the first three minutes. He doesn't waste time. He just gets on with the process and he generally looks like somebody who enjoys shooting his arrows. Yeah. And he keeps that motivation up, which is, uh, which is just great to watch. He had some cracking matches in Rio as well, didn't he? He did. He certainly, certainly did. And just after Rio, he came to uh, the World Field Championships in Dublin. He did, I remember. <laughs> that <laughs> final, he absolutely smoked that final out. I think he did take in the compounds on that day. He yes. shot absolutely ridiculous. To regain his World Field title. So again, he does everything. Yes, all-rounder. Nice shot from Tom. I'd love him to put a click on his side. I love loving Tom. Yeah. <laughs> Very strong look. Like Very strong. Inside the bow. Like Ellison is giving out a master class here. He is. He's certainly one you, you, you should take note from. Another 10. Another 10. Yes. Yeah, and, and you take it. You've got to accept it. Give a nod of the head. There we go. And Brady's yeah. not getting annoyed with it either, because this is an unknown. He's not an expectant no. to be there. Um, Brady's just sticking with his his, his own match. Brady did enjoy it. Right. Just didn't come off clean, did it? And this is where the experience tells. And he shot 329 ends. That's pretty decent yeah. out there. Brady needs a 10 to secure this third set, and he gets yeah. it and turn to move Brady. five set points to one up. Yeah. So we will have one more set. I know Tom would want another set, so Tom's he's going to... He is. He'll try and win this set, you know? We've got to draw, let's try and win one. No, Richard really pleased with the work Tom's done, so it's been good. And I said, I'm sure we'll see him elsewhere this year. Yes. He's going to the European Indoor Championship. So here we are in Nimes. Brady's leading five set points to one. Yep. So Tom will shoot first. Brady just needs to draw now to get the bronze. Big ask. All he can do is shoot tens. Mm, needs to go. Long hold. Let's go, Tom. Just out. So over to Brady. Up at full draw. Nice and tight on the face. Ten. 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 
Yep. Probably caught the line. Yeah, that's 10. And this is how he was in qualification, just going through the process. That's a nine. No, that's a nine. We can see yellow that's between the eye. Nine to win. They were close. Oh, timing's gone down a second. So I'm going to really set the clock. So Brady gets the full 20 seconds mm -hmm. yep. to shoot his last arrow. Nine to win. I'm sure he'll go for ten. No doubt there. Yeah. And he gets it. That. that was beautiful. That was, that was almost exhibition stuff from Brady. Yes. Really, wasn't it? But he will be pleased. Well, he will, but he'll still want to be shooting for gold, won't he? Oh, some words from Brady, Richard. <laughs> I know Brady's probably passing on some technique advice or something like that, because he's that kind of guy, you know? Yes, he really is. Yeah, he likes to talk about archery and talk about stuff. Oh, we're going to have an interview. <laughs> yep, Brady's like, I haven't got a clue. <laughs>